Normally, when you talk of uh, corporations, Aditya Birla Group, as uh, most people in the country know, is touching our lives almost every day in some form or the other. So the group has grown phenomenally over the last two and a half decades. It truly is a global company by any stretch of imagination. So if you look at a current portfolio today, Aditya Birla Textile really is firstly about the acrylic fiber business in Thailand, fifth largest producers in the world in acrylic. At Thai Acrylic Fiber, we started in 1989 with only 14,000 tons. Today we are 125,000 tons with our six lines and this expansion has been possible by keeping in mind what our customers want through specialty line after specialty line. One of the unique attributes about Thai Acrylic Fiber has been its constant innovation. Nowhere in the world will you find the kind of facilities for research and development and for new product development as you would find in the acrylic fiber plant in Thailand. So this facility is today up and running and producing fantastic prototype samples for the whole value creation work to happen with the partners. Our focus has been on high volume products and lots of volume. Now we are shifting our volume towards value added products. We are already at one-fourth of our turnover with value-added products and we aim to be at half of our turnover with value-added products. We are in our journey to become a global supplier of value-added acrylic fiber products. Our target is to reach a 50-50 ratio between commodities and specialities by the year 2023. Thai Acrylic Fiber has successfully developed a wide range of products so that all the products which will be required in the days to come should be available in the product basket. I can give you a couple of examples. Durashine is a dope diet fiber which is used for the UV protection for outdoor awnings as well as for the marine application. Amicor. It is an antimicrobial fiber as well as antibacterial fiber. Cryona, which is an acid dyeable fiber, which can be blended with wool and can be dyed in the same bath with the wool. Radianza is a unique green technology fiber. There is no single color effluent which comes out for online dyeing of acrylic fiber at the gel stage pill block fiber which gives absolutely a pill free appearance on the sweater after repeated use. We are setting up a new value added production line. Very soon we will be able to touch around 25 to 30 percent of value added product in our product basket. Our core focus is that we should endear ourselves to the customers, be directly connected to them, listen to their voice and constantly work on internal improvements to be able to delight them at every turn. Our focus is on long-term value creation for our customers. It is not only about the quality of our products, but the quality of our interaction with our customers in line with the customer vision of our group. Our focus towards value-added products is exemplified by commissioning Line 6 by the end of this year. The line would be laced with a lot of technological innovations which will address the ever-changing needs of the customer and the marketplace. The 
purpose of all this is to ensure that OTIFs go up. This whole supply chain management of the value chain is really all about customer centricity and all about delighting your customer. Thai Acrylic Fiber is a global company and our customers are spread across the five continents in the world. To service these customers well, our supply chain and logistics functions are very well interlinked and are completely in the system. The textile business is doing a, an excellent job at moving to international standards. They're looking at their practices in the factories, chemical management, waste, uh, safety, health, and making sure that they operate not just to the law but to international standards. They're also doing an excellent job of looking at the future and they're already taking actions as to how to make sure we're able to supply our customers in the long term. Sustainability has become a way of life. Creating the whole framework for measuring sustainability, use of the HIG index as part of the Sustainable Apparel Coalition, which is what brands are looking for. High acrylic fiber is the greenest acrylic fiber plant in the world. Our endeavor always has been to create green and sustainable operations and green and sustainable products. Being a value-added product player brings in a lot of challenges and opportunities. Challenges in terms of developing a product pipeline through our R&D efforts and opportunities in terms of serving to a wider market and more customers and delivering more profits for the business. What we try to do, building sustainability in the product at the ideation stage of product development so that it remains with the product in their entire life cycle. I think as a corporation, a lot of work has been done by the Azitabila Group in the area of community social welfare. We have rolled out our digital journey and vision in the past one year. In the next six months, all of our buying decisions would be governed by data analytics. Data analytics, AI, VI, and IoT will deliver business growth and customer centricity simultaneously. In addition to our work on value-added products, in addition to our work on sustainability, the five values of integrity, commitment, passion, seamlessness, and speed are embedded in all our activities, value systems, performance KPIs, all our future development, R&D and collaboration efforts are towards value creation for thiatelic fiber and value creation for our customers. Our growth and expansion and modernization is a continuous way of life at the other similar group textile business. We are working towards creating a globally sustainable corporation which will excel and become a gold standard in the years to come.